All right, guys, I know you're worried about the traumatic World Series that's been going on, but let's go back to a little reality check. The presidential debate occurred, the last one, well, the supposed last one, between the same candidates, Governor Romney and Obama, which in the foreign policy debate that occurred this week shows how just the same they really are. The media continues to even admit that on air, and they still, people still seem to swallow that and think that Romney and Obama are somehow different from each other. And it continues to show that even on networks like Glenn Beck, Rand Paul comes on Glenn Beck's show saying Romney and Obama's foreign policy aren't really different, because they're not different. A third party presidential debate, which you may not have heard, actually occurred this week. Four candidates from each different party debating actual real issues, such as the NDAA, drones, the kill list assassinations, the continuous war on drugs, you know, real questions that should be asked that the corporate media we're still waiting for hasn't reported on the debate and still waiting for them to cover it. It continues to show how most mainstream media outlets didn't even cover the third party debate and to show that we actually have real choices in an election instead of giving us two of the same illusion of choice and voting for the lesser of two evils. So this is Jeff Durkin and this has been your We Are Change Connecticut weekly wrap up. This week we talked to Dave Wagner who is an activist fighting fluoride in the 1960s in Connecticut. Also, we did three videos talking, highlighting the Federal Reserve false flag bomb plot, which never succeeded, and the FBI totally helped involved with that. And don't forget to subscribe at the top to We Are Change Connecticut.